The Bunyip. I told you in a previous letter about the capture by my brother-in-law, Mr H. de Salas, of a wombat-like animal which was first seen in the Murrumbidgee. When I was in Sydney recently, I inspected the stuffed wombats in the museum and am now able to say that the animal which was captured was not a common wombat. The shortness and greater breadth of its head and its flat face undoubtedly differentiated from the common wombat, which was it differed in those respects nearly as much as does a pug dog from a fox terrier. I have no longer hesitation in expressing an opinion that this animal was a water wombat and that it will probably be found to differ as much from the common wombat as a water rat does from a common rat. The facts you brought forward, as well as others which have come under my notice, lead me to think that the animal is not very uncommon. Yours faithfully, William Farrer, Lambrig, 